So Olivia, two years ago you were a sprint and technical world champion. Now you're inflatable world champion. Inflatable. <laughs> what about look at that? this medal. It's so cool. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it was super cool to race today on the inflatable. Even if I put a lot of hours on the foil, so I decide to not doing the elite race. Maybe, maybe not uh, switching to the foil uh, world. And uh, yeah, I am super happy to to share this event anyway on the Incredible. And I think the Incredible it's kind of one part of the future of the sport, especially for junior amateur and everyone that wants to travel with the board on the train and on the plane on a on a backpack. So yeah, I'm super happy to be part of it. And thank you. Uh, the ICF uh, World Championship for, for this uh, all this sharing, all these good vibes and super happy to be here. Yeah, I mean the good thing about that race, there were a lot of people there who were doing it for the first time I think uh, in a race type situation and that's the good thing about Inflatable. Yeah, 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 it's a mix of many, many paddlers, like people are super professional and like train a lot and some people just do it for fun and it's great to share it anyway like in in, like me coming from windsurfing, we have a lot of races like that with pro and amateur, and that's what we do in sub, and I, I think it's a very good thing for the sport. Now, what about you, Olivia? I'm going to put you on the spot right here, right now. Are you going to keep going with stand up paddling, or what do you want to do? I like keep going. Uh, like uh, a sport I love, yes, because I more like about the competition, like it's uh, a sport that I will always practice for myself. And then on the on the elite part, it's just that in life I think you have different um, like different way to express yourself. And for me today, I I I choose the the foil. Yeah. Yeah. And it's super hard to do to sport at the at the at the high level. So I I prefer to do the the things that and I 100%. And thanks to the inflatable division, yeah. I can also enjoy the the race. Yeah. And as an athlete, I'm like today. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a water woman, but I'm more focused on the foil and and at, like for the question, do you stop stop racing? I don't know. I just don't know because. It's hard to say yes to this question, and I prefer the um, like to yeah to let it go and to, yeah. to see what what happened. Now, what about uh, for this World Championships? It's for you. It's been from a different view from two years ago. You're an elite athlete. This time, you've yeah. been on the other side. What do you think of this? Uh, yeah, watch? it's 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 great because you can enjoy the race, watching the race, and commenting too. Yes. And it's at the same time weird because you have I haven't I, I have not the same position, and people are like sometimes disappointed, and sometimes they totally understand that I that you have to make choice in life. Hmm. Uh, so. And yeah, me personally, I enjoy it anyway. Yeah. And yeah. I, yeah, like I say, I'm super happy to be here, and I love sub and whatever, whatever my like, whatever I, I do, I yeah. love it. Well, great to have you as a world champion again. So great, <laughs> and it's been great to have you as part of the uh, the commentary team this week, and uh, being so passionate doing the development stuff as well. You've been ultra busy. Yeah, yeah it was uh, great. Yeah, thanks, Olivia. All the best. Hopefully, we'll see you in Poland next year. Yeah, I think so. Doing the inflatable, the inflatable division, for yeah, sure. Yeah, good stuff. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you.